Imperian fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperian Galactic Survival Iron Man Season 8. This is your host, Zelot from Geek Tech Industries, and yes, I am still alive. And here, I'll show you that. Let's, um, I'm just going to go it into third person here for a second. And let's take a look at what I forgot to show last episode at the end of the last episode was this this in particular zero deaths so I'm still alive I'm only level four but whatever whatever I don't care I'm still alive and I have this ready to cook or ready to go it's cooked up and so we're gonna actually spawn this in here oh uh, get off my head what really Okay, let's go, like, over there. <laughs> okay. Woo! Swing it around like a bat. Okay, let's, come on, right there. There we go. That looks good. Nice. <clears throat> a little ramp up to the uh, constructor. So, here we go. My, my Alpha 8 Starter HV. Yeah, it's ugly as sin. But, it actually handles pretty good. It's probably the best starter HV I've ever made, to tell you the truth, in the way of for handling and cost. Uh, it also has a constructor equipped on it, which I think is quite important. It's pretty bare bones inside here, though. I do plan on putting another cockpit on the inside and sealing this up with a grate and putting a ventilator in here with, with O2 tanks. And This will be sealed in by the environment, and then I can... I can fly around inside without having to get out and, you know, spawn my drone by going like, well, but really? Come on. Thank you. <clears throat> you know, do that. And then I'm out of line of sight. And for right now, that'll, that'll work with critters for now. Um, it also allows me to jump into the cockpit from here. So let's go in here and... Throw some fuel in. I've got 30. So all right, we'll put we'll keep a couple a few on us here. We'll throw all that in. Oops, I've got any steel plates on me from taking out one of the blocks there. Okay. Um, basically actually at this point we should make a custom switch. And I'm just going to, whoa, no, I'm not going to call it that. <laughs> Let's call it that. And <clears throat> um, I also want to then auto group everything. And we will put this. On the engines, the RCS on the engines. Whoops, on the engines. And the thruster groups in the engines. This just lets me turn off the real, the all the anything that makes it move and consume a lot of fuel. So, yeah, that uh, that's ready to go. What we'll do now is we'll just jump out for a second. Um, oh, did I not shut it off? Let's take a look. So I've got that. Let's shut the engines off. And the power is off, so I can leave that turned off for now. And I will get all this stuff together, put it in the HV. So I'm going to transfer it, everything in there. And once I got it all transferred in, I will be back. Okay, we're back. So finally, it just took forever to construct everything that I wanted. And, but I think now we're ready. I've got everything made pretty much that we're going to use right now to do a little exploring. But I'm going to get some more going too. So we've got some lights going good. 
and some more ammo. I've got this stuff to put in. I made some a couple Gatling guns, harvest module, the cargo box for the harvest module, the uh, small ammo box, and some uh, 15 mil bullets for the Gatling guns. I'm just cooking up the spotlights right now. Um, and it'll make some more ammo, but we also should make some more RCS because it's going to need it. Let's make four of those. We're going to start running into an iron problem. So we, we need to go get more resources, especially iron. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> uh, I'm, yeah. I, I need four more thrusters. Let's hope we can do this. Let's, um, yeah, I want to eat up all that. And I'm going to, just going to put that down to that, so we'll have a thousand. That's good enough. Good enough for now. We need to get more resources. But, but this HV will get us started. I put a fridge in it already. So I unlocked level five. Well, while this thing was constructing stuff, um, really, buddy? Huh. They have been really annoying me the whole time I've been here. <laughs> they just, they just are constantly coming around and shaking their booty at me. I don't know if they're, if they want to mate with me or kill me. I'm just, I'm confused and I don't want to deal with it anymore. Um, okay. So, let's get this stuff in. Let's get this stuff in. Let's put a couple guns here. And we're going to put the harvest module on the front here. Right there. Okay. So... Let's get this stuff in the back here. And that's fine. And we'll just put that right there. That's fine. Okay, we can just throw that in there. So we can go into the constructor, grab the rest of this stuff. Oh yeah, we'll be able to make that stuff, hopefully. Yeah. It'll be close. Okay, let's put these lights on. So we'll put the lights right here. And we'll do this one like, like that. And then like that there. That gives it a nice wide nice wide light spread okay um, so that's awesome we're pretty much ready to go now as it stands with the gear that we got loaded but realistically without these extra RCS so here's a couple there's a couple that'll help right now definitely Put one there Another one there. Okay. Let's. Actually, you know what? I put a. I don't need to jump into here. Let's turn my light on so it should stay on now when I jump in and out of the vehicle. I put a cockpit in here and I got the grate in so it's sealed now so we can just drive it from here now. Okay. Um. Well, let's get this thing off the ground. And we'll have to put some more fuel in. Let's give it another five at least. We got to go get some more wood. And load up our guns. So what? He just... He... Really, buddy? You are, oh good, actually, with those two RCS, I can actually aim up and down quite well. With the other two that it's cooking up, it'll be even better. 
But I'm thinking I need to kill him, although he's he's on. I don't want to dent my stuff. Maybe he'll just despawn. Let's not worry about it. Let's go get some wood. And oh yeah, we can't harvest rocks with the with the um, harvester anymore apparently. And let's just confirm that. So as of a recent update, cannot damage the target with this weapon. Yep. So we can do it to critters though, and trees still. One log. <laughs> yeah, it's only a log. Bunch of copper down here though. So let's get some of these trees. I'm gonna get this burning into biofuel right away. Here. Okay, so let's let's get this going on biofuel. Oops, I gotta grab it out of the um, harvest box first. building those. <laughs> I keep forgetting the constructor's so freaking slow on these settings. <coughs> well, let's get 20 going when it does finally start cooking them. So we can put these other two in right now. Let's jump out. And so yeah, I know I don't have armor on right now. You know what? I don't necessarily need it right now for this stage that I'm at in the game. And I'll be able to get it pretty quick anyway. What I needed to do is seal up this HV and get it uh, get it critter worthy. Which means drones too, really. Um, so I have to get those RCSs on there. Or else I just can't aim. I can't aim with it if, uh, if I don't have those on. So uh, okay, well, we got those in now. So, yeah, we can point up and we can go right down. Okay, good. So that's much, much better. We need the thrusters now. So what, what I'm going to do is I can, I can jump out, spawn my drone, and you can see I'm, I'm perfectly... Here, I'll tab in, tab out, so you can see the temperature uh, is fine where I'm at. See, it's it's eight degrees outside, and I'd be dying, but because I have the sealed environment that I'm in, I can have my drone out and not freeze to death, which allows me to do this sort of stuff, which includes mining. So yeah, uh, I can't cut down trees though with the drone. <clears throat> I haven't figured out a way to do that yet, and you can't pick stuff with the drone, so it's not it's not the ultimate tool, but um, it would be a way. It, a lot of people think it's already too overpowered, and uh, yes and no, yes and no. I think um, I think maybe. Oops. Yeah, let's shoot the tree. That's what I want to do. I think. Maybe making it an actual device that you gotta construct. You know what? There's so many of these around here. I, I, I'll, I'll jump out, and spawn my drone. Oh. Sometimes it spawns you in an awkward spot, so you just use your drone to like knock you. In. <laughs> um, okay, so where are all those? There's one. somewhere and I can't see it now. Oh, there it is. Okay. I thought there was more than that, but I can't. It's getting too dark. I don't have... Oh, there it is. 
It's not they it's not like they just completely stick right out. Okay. No more? No more uh No more rocks? Oh no, there's another one. Thought there was a bunch around here. Okay. Is that it? Okay, 21 just from that one little stop. That's nice, that's nice. But I really need iron more than, I think I, I think that other stuff was iron and I just left it there, didn't I? Yeah, the ones that I had tested. So there's some copper there, all these trees. Um, yeah, it's too bad the harvester can't do those now. Oh, well, I can do these trees. We'll need the bowels more. And now that I got the fridge, the food, the food isn't just insto spoiling anymore, which is great. And driving around does not consume more than the normal amount of food, so. That's fantastic too. Okay. So where are we? Okay, so we could go mine out the rest of these and that's probably a good idea. I think that's what I'm going to go do. Let's go check out and see what the situation is over there. I, oh, you know what I should do? You know what I should do is get... Oh, I can't make it. Water generators. I can't make water generators. Huh. Wow, only survive. Well, okay, I, can, I guess we'll go plop a, survive, or a uh, portable constructor down, and because I know they make them for sure, I made one just recently in a portable constructor. So there's a small wreckage we could go check out too. Now we'll be getting into potential baddie zone, so we're potential into like spider spiders and spitty bugs so we've got to be careful now oh there's some silicone silicone and copper let's get look at that we can reach a whole bunch of them from here now let's chop this down Make it a little easier to see okay so we've got silicone behind us at like four o'clock. So let's go do that. <clears throat> Come on. Okay, and then we had a whole bunch of copper just like everywhere. There was some over here too. It was just Harder to see in the there's there's a piece there. Yeah, I know this isn't very thrilling for you guys, but you know what? I don't need to unnecessarily risk myself doing something stupid right now. It's still really early on in the competition. I want to try and get as far as possible. So Pretty much everything I'm going to do is, is as low risk as possible. Sorry. <laughs> it's a competition, it's not a playthrough, okay? If I die, the game is over. So I can't die. And that's the whole point. Oh, yeah, that was great. Was drill arm. Careful of like spitty bugs. 
their homing plasma balls of, of dermal burn frickin' nightmare. Okay, let's let's just head over and finish mining the um, deposits out. seaweed down there. Deep water. Wow. Okay. Well, let's check it out, actually. Is there, is there seaweed down here? Possibly. Yep. There's some right there. Huh. Interesting. Is there any... Uh, yep, there's plasma, too. Okay. Well, that's good to know, but it's there's way bigger lakes on this planet. Uh, I don't know what I'm getting all excited about. <laughs> Just, I don't know. Uh, oh, look at that! Our friendly neighborhood plant monster. <clears throat> you know what? I think I think he qualifies to be the next contestant on He Must Die for the Cause. Come on. Are you just going to stand there and let me kill you? Yeah, you're awesome. Thanks, buddy. You got any, like, decent sprouts or something? I'll take your sprouts. Oh, wow. Dig him up. <laughs> I'd put him six feet under. <laughs> under the stone. Wow, that's pretty impressive. He died hard. Come on, really? <laughs> okay, mate, there we go. Oh, worth it, worth it. Corn sprout. Absolutely worth it. Uh, I don't see any spiders. I'm trying to look for spiders. I mean, if there's plant monsters out, that means that there's spiders too. I just don't know where their spawns are. I'll find out. Hopefully, there's n they're not all like saturated around the deposits. That would suck. Oh, night raptor. Huh. You know what? I could do. Let's let's go into our PDA, and we're just gonna. I think I can activate one of these. Let's check the info. Raptor. Uh, I think it has to be not afraid of the dark temperate night creatures. Night raptor. Plant. Yeah, I should have I should have had this going. Okay, so let's <clears throat> let's do this. We're going to activate that. And then... Let's see how accurate this thing is. Not bad. Got a thousand XP for that too. That's good. I'll take his meat. Okay, eggs then. Eggs, yeah. 
seems like every single time I kill one of those things, it's female. Okay. Mm. I don't see any spitty bugs or anything. I'm not going to worry about the wreckage right now. Let's just get this. Copper. I'm not going to worry about the rocks either. Oh, is that a. No? Okay, good. Raise up a bit here. Just in case there are spiders, then. Please, no spiders. Please, no. Sp oh, spiders. <laughs> yep, of course. Oh, come on. Their hitboxes are just insane. Oh, now I can't see. Yeah, great. Okay. They are dead. Thrust. Okay, was that it for spiders? I think so. Okay. How's this thing doing? Good. Good. Okay, uh, I am going to mine this out and be right back. Well, we are done all the mining. You can see it's raining out, and yeah, I got a unicorn horn on the front now. Uh, I was able to make a detector, put it on there. I also got an armor locker installed and because I did hit six level from killing a couple critters I made some light armor too <clears throat> so we can go ahead and put that on I guess it's just eh. um, I will consume my food a little faster wearing it though so I'm not really sure if it's worth putting on right now but eh. gives me gives me a helmet that I can take off and on. No, it, it gives me a higher comfort zone with the radiation protection too on the outside. Uh, you can see my food consumption just went up quite a bit though, 44%. So I'm like, that's not going to be good. Okay, but that's okay actually. Right now we actually got quite a bit of food. So you can see on our radar we actually have three outside bars and three inside bars so the outside bars is direction the inside bars are how many in that direction <coughs> um, there's nothing to the north but to the east let's let's we're facing east right now we we actually need promethium really bad really bad we need to find promethium Without getting shot by spitty bugs. So, not sure where we're gonna find that. Oh, there's sand here. Sometimes there's golems in sandy areas. Golems can actually drop Prometheum. Hmm. Hmm. Come on, Golems. Spawn for me. It's 
a fairly decent sized sandy area. We might have a good shot of finding a golem here. golems. Oh, there we go. There's a golem. Okay. So kill him. 2100 XP. That's awesome. And loot him. Yeah, 9 Promethium, what I tell you? Awesome. With some Neo, too, which is that might be the only way to get Neo on this planet is killing those stupid things and, and maybe looting stuff from drones, I guess, maybe? So where are we right now? We're over here. Okay. So it looks like there's another desert area down there. of those. That'll give us 18. Actually, let's do six, five. That'll give us 10 because I wouldn't mind doing a multi-tool and some chargers if, if I can. see now I can't find it. Um what? there he is. <laughs> like what where did I leave him? Ooh, Sathium, Cobalt Yeah, silicone I, so all stuff I need right now. So that's awesome. Get out of there. Get out of there. that in there. Good stuff. That's really good stuff. Okay. Grab some of these fuel packs. I should get the water thing going too, but I don't think I need to go to space quite yet, and realistically all that's out there, we're not allowed to leave the sector anyway, so... Doesn't look like we'll be leaving the sector at all this this uh, this season. Well, that helped. Uh, okay, so should we figure out what is what then? We've got west. Southwest. Uh, that's kind of the direction we want to go. So let's do that. Come on, big guys. Where are you? Come 
Come on, Golem, Golem. Come on. You know you want to come out and get shot by me. Everyone wants to get shot by me. <laughs> uh, okay, this is a little boring. Hunting for stuff, so we're not going to. Um, but we will kill this thing. Because, yeah, another thousand XP. An egg, one single egg. Wow, so worth it. Uh, well, the thousand XP at this point is worth it. Oh, wow, this is quite a large sandy area. Start at the beginning here. Come on, Golem, Golem. That's not that big of a sandy area. Not big enough for a Golem. Oh, yes, it is. Woo! Level seven. Woo! Stop it. Just... Okay, turn my jetpack on then. What is going on? Whoa! <laughs> Bloody hell. Ugh. Why am I stuck? There. That was weird. It's all good stuff. It's all good stuff. Well, huh. hmm. I mean, I guess I'll keep heading west. I'm going fairly slow is because um, if it is a enemy POI, it, there might be patrols uh, a thousand meters out from it. Small wreckage, really. Well, let's check the sand by. Well, might as well grab it while we're here, right? Waste not, want not.
Okay. Well, it says we got something to the east now. That was the map, so it's east now, eh? All the way, really? To the east? Small wreckage. Oh, that might be the starting biome. Huh. And so that's the alien tower down there. pretty happening. Let's, um, let's gather all these. I mean, there's enough to stop and gather them. And the reason I'm going so slow is because potentially at a thousand kilometers out from wherever that thing is, whatever it is to the east, if it's an enemy POI, there might be patrols. South and try, oh, now it's now it's four things to the east. Yeah, this will be this will be guaranteed an enemy POI. So I eh, not really sure if I should continue on this direction because. good. At night it's harder to see too, right? So, of course, we got to be even more cautious. Well, you know what guys I think we did pretty good 
I'm going to leave the episode off here. Um, yeah, the pretty much, I'm going to sneak into the east there and just kind of see, oh, is that a radiated biome? Okay, let's, let's, let's just take a little peek. We're just going to take a peek. Because if there's no enemy POIs, it might be a whole bunch of Prometheum. So, so it's worth it's worth kind of taking a peek here. If there's fortifications, I'm going to be dead. I don't see any patrols. Just the alien bugs. Assassin. Oh, I see some, uh, well, there's lots of attacks in here. Radiant fog, that's okay, I should be able to handle it in my, uh, my light armor. So there's going to be a whole bunch of spiders, I bet. Okay, well, um, and these, those, those glowy trees, the real gnarly looking ones, they give a ton of wood, and they're really easy to cut down, so I think I'm going to cut down some of those, I'm going to slowly work my way through here and try and get as much Prometheum and Cobalt that I can, and yeah, so next episode, hopefully I'll have enough resources to... <coughs> get a base of some sort going I think is the next uh, the next logical conclusion or <clears throat> and we can go check out parts of the uh, Robson protocol I think we'll continue on with that pretty quick here and uh, try and look for the Titan parts and get some good good loot uh, well guys that'll be next episode so until then you guys have yourselves an awesome awesome day.